All right, hi everyone and welcome to Visba's week 10 uh, social where we get to have our final meeting of the 2021 2020 2021 school year. I personally and we as an executive board sincerely appreciate all of our members who have been joining our meetings consistently throughout this school year. Without you, there would be no Bisba, and so we are truly grateful for your dedication and commitment to our organization. So without further ado, we'll get the ball rolling for tonight. All right, so what's our agenda? So real quick, just go over a couple quick announcements, do a little bit of a senior spotlight to honor our departing seniors. We're going to miss you guys a lot. We're also going to do some icebreakers and then do some sports debates as well. Also, we want to give a huge congratulations to our case competition winners, Arnav Talukter, John Crotin, Jake Kanyoff, and Gary Saxon. I hope I'm saying those all right. Congratulations for winning our first ever virtual case competition. So I'll give them a hand. And also, we want to congratulate our most dedicated member, Nathan Wu. As a reward for your dedication, you'll be sent this football t-shirt as a thanks for your loyalty. So thank you. All right, you guys all know our attendance policy is the last meeting, doesn't matter, but we look forward to having some cool field trips next year. All right, so like I kind of mentioned earlier, we want to take a moment and recognize a few of our board members who will be graduating UCLA this year. So as many of you know, we've been blessed to have some awesome seniors as a part of our executive board these last few years that our group would not be in the position it is in today if it weren't for their hard work and loyalty to business mission of preparing undergraduates to enter the sports industry. With this in mind, we wanna give a special shout out to these individuals who will be graduating and moving on to bigger and better things starting this summer. So with this in mind, I'd like to ask our departing seniors to please share a little bit about their time in BISBA, what it's meant to them, their next steps, and any advice they'd like to leave with us younger BISBA members. So first, I'll, uh, I'll stop sharing screen and we'll start with Christina Schenel. Take it away, Christina. Wow, I feel like I'm going to get emotional. I, this is crazy. This is like my last BISM meeting. Um, wow, yeah, no, this is just like such a crazy journey. I think that it's been, and like I'm so happy with just like how much progress BISBA has made and what it's just become. Um, it's just crazy to think like something that you create or an idea that you have, like it's really can come into fruition. And just like even just seeing everyone on this call and like all the speakers we've had and just like how much people have gotten out of it, how much I've gotten out of it. Um, oh, I'm coming back as a guest speaker. <laughs> um, yeah, no, it's just, it's so wild to like, think about that. And just how cool I think it's even been um, having the sense of community throughout this pandemic as well. So um, yeah, Bisba has meant a lot for me. It's kept me on top of my game in regards to like, actually like networking and things like that. I think it's one of the best ways to just like stay on top of it. And even as long as I've been here in grad school and stuff like that, it's really paid off. So like it never, like it never, I feel like ran out of like returns that it offered me back. So that's something I'm super, super excited for. Um, yeah, I'm super excited to be going to Nike soon. Um, and that's like a dream job for me. And I think it's crazy to think, cause when I started this club, I was like interning at Under Armour. And so just crazy to see like the progress of the club as like it's paralleled my life too. So um, now that I'm actually getting ready to go to my first like real job, that's going to be wild. Um, super, super excited. Yeah. And if anyone like uh, has any like questions or like interest in Nike and stuff like that, feel free to hit me up, um, especially the people, you know, on this call. And um, yeah, like it's just been such an exciting journey and like privileged to have been like the president too. So excited that Colin's now leading the group too. So um, yeah, super excited. And I think, I guess, with regards to like advice for everyone too, um, like networking, 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 like that's basically what this um, organization is and what it does and helps you do. But even it's just like how, like if there's a speaker that you're interested in or even just works at an organization that maybe can know someone that you'd be interested in speaking to, like utilize that. Um, I know that's how I got like my internships and my like job too, is just like kind of like how you can keep talking to people and get introduced and like that just helps like interview processes so, so, so much. So um, this was an amazing place and space to grow um, and definitely just like the amount you put in is like kind of like what you can get out of it. So that's, I guess, some of like my parting words, but um, yeah, I appreciate you guys all dearly. Um, and if you guys ever need anything from me, um, you can hit me up, just text me or whatever. Um, and yeah.
I'm excited for for everyone else too. Of course, yeah. Thank you for that. That was really well said. Um, so next up, Jada, would you like to say a few words about uh, you know, what you're up to? Any advice you'd have to share? So hopefully I don't go on a coffee tangent. I just choked on some tea. So hopefully I don't go on a coffee on a coughing tangent right now. Plus also my allergies. Oh, <laughs> leave me alone, Christina. <laughs> Plus also my allergies has been going through the roof. So, but I'm gonna make sure to get tested, but just in case. Um, so I've only been with Bizva for this year. And thank you, Christina, for allowing me to join um, this year, not just because I'm your roommate, but this was also really beneficial in so many levels in so many ways. Um, for me, not knowing what I was going to do, at least in the sports business world, being here has allowed me to meet new people, have pretty incredible <clears throat> guest speakers, but also being able to interact with you guys has been inspirational. And just seeing how hard everyone works for this organization for it to stay up and for it to be as successful as it is and it's going to be going to continue to be successful with the leadership of Colin and the rest of the e-board members that we do have here on um, Zoom and even in Vespa as well so I'm very fortunate to have worked alongside you guys over this past year and I do believe that my growth here uh, working in the event planning team has been huge and in going into the sports world whether it's in marketing or broadcasting or whatever it is, uh, just being able to network has been key. Um, networking with you guys, networking with guest speakers that we've had here. So I'm very fortunate that I've been able to be a part of this organization this past year. And I know it's gonna do great things going forward. So thank you all for having me this past year. And um, I will be in touch as an alum some way, somehow, but um, hope you guys continue all the great work that you did this year. Yeah. Very well said. I thought for a second, maybe you were just being really emotional about leaving Bisba. you know, the classic allergy excuse, but no, it, it looks legit. It looks legit. Uh, so next up, uh, Emily Hong, would you like to say a few words? Yeah, um, I've also been at Bisba for a short time. I wish I would have known about this longer, but um, I'm just thankful for the opportunity. I think joining this club has made me realize that my dream job would be to like work in sports, um, specifically for the NFL for the Olympics. So I'm grateful that it led me to like the direction and um, I graduated back in December of fall 2020 and I'm just lucky that I was able to continue to be a part of this club and contribute to it. Um, thanks for the e members for allowing me to be part of this club. Um, I think there's tremendous opportunity and um, I hope to contribute to it in the future. Definitely. Yeah. Thank you for that. And we're glad, we're glad you were able to join and 